And then in close, Ray Peer misses the rebound. Connell Crossland. Crossland Ooh, gives nice. it up. Pretty reverse. And for those of you watching tonight that have watched our games previously, as Brent Shuck pops from all. Shuck for three. Yes, sir. L. Johnson over to Brian Allen to Shuck in the corner. Three on the way. Yes. Yeah. Now somebody will understand. Bryant to Williams. Now to Shuck. Three-pointer on the way. Yes. Got a beautiful shot. Nice release. Shoots it at the top of his jump. Nothing but nylon. That's Shuck's third three of the quarter. Good defender, excellent outside shooter. Shuck kind of moves like him, shoots like him. Moves he, to his spot. Yep, even, even looks like him facially. He's open. Uh. Yes! Shuck again, fourth three of the quarter. In this half, 39-37, by far the lowest scoring game in the league this season. Oh, Shuck from Shuck. way outside, oh. yes! <laughs> <laughs> but how about Brent Shuck? Oh, yeah, he, uh, you know, there's no hesitation. I mean, I know that shot, the clock was running out, but there's no hesitation. No, that was. You know, he, he knows where, when, and how. Let's take a look at the halftime stats. First for the steam, Rent Shuck. Five of six from three-point range. He's got 15 points. Collins, Ray Pierre, Ware, Patton, and Jarrell Thomas, same starting five. Shuck gets the outside jumper to start off the second half for the steam. Ooh, easy, Little easy, Stop and go easy. acceleration. Yeah, that was nice. Change speeds. Nice block the by other Patton. End, it's Brett Shuck. Pontiac 66ers and Windy City Groove. After one quarter, the Groove lead by three, 25-22. Now Shook hits as the shot clock winds down. Now Shook faking the shot on Green. Now the step back jumper left side. That's. <laughs>
，表现，要高能队员。Ray Pierre also had four rebounds in that first quarter. Oh, Rapier looking to inbound, finally gets it into Patton. He's working on Shuck. Baseline left side, picks up the dribble, just about turns it over, and then does. Two on one for the steam getting back is Jarrell Thomas, but they score on the transition bucket, and it's an 8-4 lead for the steam. Another turnover. Oh. And their defense, there goes that defense. And Leonard Bryant, same starting five for Milton Stiff. Ware turns and shoots it over Brent Shuck. Shot won't go. Rebound yeah, tracked Ray down Pierre. by Ray Pierre. Nice end post. The Patton's floater is. Massey left side. Now to Green, guarded by Shuck. Green bowls his way to the lane, loses the ball. A Bocock right wing. Driving on Williams, kicking it out. Now Green for three. That's no good, and the rebound taken by Anthony Jones. Jones to the left elbow, picks up the dribble underneath, is shook, and that shot's good. Fulton cannot make it a one-point game. 6.34 to play. Massey on the drive. Kicks it out. Roper, long baseline jumper. Air back out to Bocott. Bocott blows past good. Soars into the lane. Can't hit with the left hand. Shook the rebound. Now it gets swatted out of there by Bocott, and JB gets called for the. F so Shook will go to the free throw line, and for as good as he is from beyond three point range, I should say from three point range, he hits his first there. Gets them both. And missing.
And Jimmy, the Windy City Groove looked to be having some success offensively, and then during the timeout, I think you could tell that Milton Stith said, you guys better get up off your hind ends and play some defense. And oh, that's yeah. what they've been doing. And Windy City's offensive capabilities have dried up. Yeah, everything has picked up the defensive intensity. Uh, and you got to always have it. You got to start with that. But the defensive intensity has picked up. And uh, some bad shots have been taken. Not a lot of them, but some bad shots by Windy City. And I think this game is going to be won like we saw. And, and a three-second call against Windy City. So now it's gateway ball. Shuck for three. 